We have to. Okay, so we gotta get in there regardless. You said. I could worry about looting after. You are wrong about these crazy sons of. Hey, we on the. Whoa. Okay, hold on. Right. Oh wow. He one taps. I was trying to get all three of them with one dead eye. I didn't know he was that fire close up. What is good YouTube? It's your boy Most Hated JC back at y'all with another episode of that Red Dead Redemption 2. My brothers and sisters, last episode, one of the most active Red Dead episodes we've had so far. And trust me, that's no easy feat. <laughs> we somehow got through our Gwarma arc and we are right back at home. For who knows how long, bro. But even though the, almost the whole gang is back together, we still have to deal with Pinkertons. <laughs> who would have guessed? And getting our boy John Marston back out of that jail, bro. And all I'm saying is, where the hell has Jack been? Because <laughs> I know for damn sure we didn't take him on that bank job, bro. So where the hell has Jack been from that point to us all getting separated, to John getting arrested, Abigail getting arrested to him not being at our lakay house because i know he wasn't in that shootout with a rifle either <laughs> where the hell is john's son and today i know first things first i want to start off with before like well mission wise you know i still gotta like maintain my facial hair and stuff i want to make sure we get john marston back first things first before we see what the heck does got in store for us so hey man without any further ado because you know i don't want to keep y'all waiting too long and don't need too much to yap on the story used to speak for itself with this game bro i could finally bring back the world without saying let's go stand on some wild western business All right, y'all, we back with that boy Arthur at the new camp. I'm not gonna lie, your beard won't grow any longer unless you use hair tunic. Each use the hair tunic will allow you beard to grow a little bit longer. Actually, speaking of that, <laughs> shout out to homie in the comments. Apparently, I've been saying it wrong. It's tonic, I think you said it was, instead of tunic. I don't know where the hell I got uh, tunic from. To me, that sounds better. My dead eye has improved. But, you know, I haven't been saying it right, and what is this, episode 20? I'm not gonna lie, I think it's too late for me to start saying it right. So, if that annoys anybody, that's my fault. But just so you're aware, somebody has corrected me on that. But, I just don't know if I could... Oh, uh, what's good, Pearson? Good to see you again. What do we do now? I just don't know if I can make that correction. Right. I'll speak to Dutch. After I get my beard all nice and shaved and stuff. Like, you know how if you say something a certain way for so long, like, you know, it's just muscle memory. It's hard to re to retrain that. I'll try my best, though. Because don't want to know. Good morning. Oh! There's little man! I'm scared, Uncle Arthur. All that shooting. I don't blame him. Uh, we're going to move somewhere safe, okay? Yeah, hopefully. All right, well, that answers my question. That's Another morning. Uh, what's good, Mary good Beth? What's good, again, Karen? Dad. Where's Molly, by the way? Hey, how you doing? Nobody's seen her in ages. Good riddance, I say. Oh, uh, damn. Okay. She ain't get back with the gang. How you feeling, Mary Beth? <sighs> it's good to see you again. Right. Despite the circumstances. The house all lit up. You too. Golly. Well, what do we do now? We yeah, need I don't to know. Move. Right. As soon as possible. We've got a couple of days. We just got to make sure we get John back. So Molly O'Shea is not even back with us now. I never even peeped that. Is this my stuff right here? Okay. Search drawer. Wait, really? What's in here? Wardrobe? Oh, gun oil? What? It don't look like there's nowhere for me to uh <laughs> change my beard and stuff, y'all. So I guess we just gonna get straight to the missions today, man. Yeah, Dutch, I already know you finna have me do some crazy stuff, so... First things first, I think I'm gonna hit up the homie Charles, then go to Sadie, and then circle back for you, Dutch, because I already know you're gonna be on some wild boy stuff. 
And maybe while I'm in the town, I guess I could visit the barber. Because uh, if it's here, y'all, I just can't find it. I don't know how the hell I'm supposed to shave my beard, man. It's a little wild. You know what I mean? The handlebar mustache coming in nicely, but you know. Who is that? Oh, what's good, Reverend? It's good to see you again. Right after so long. You too. But this is a mess. A real mess. Oh, trust me. I know, bro. <laughs> trust that I know. I'm finna go <clears throat> try and eat some of my problems. You you good, Pearson? Like, um, but yeah, bro. Situation is crazy right now, y'all. Like, like, like I said, the, the episodes be speaking for themselves, man. Hello, this horse Mark. belongs to Micah. Oh, I didn't mean Bill. I'm starting to wish we'd stayed on. Guam. You brought the Pinkertons to I us. Lead them here, Morgan. I swear it. Yes, you did, bro. Uh, it don't matter either way. <laughs> you asked everybody in town, right? Okay. Guess I'll leave you to it then. <sighs> okay. And then he wonders why he's the prize idiot, bro. He wonders why. All right, let's go. Uh, I also want to take this store to the stables. This horse to the stables and name it, bro. This is Clementine 2.0 right here. Uh, Clementine the second. Hi, Charles. Guys, nice to see hey. you again, Playboy. How are you, Cope? All right, talk to um, me. Uh, okay. That's it. Just keep your fingers crossed. Yeah, stay ten toes, brother. Yeah. All right, man. We out of here. Yeah, I think I want to bring this horse to the stables so I could officially make it Clementine 2.0. You feel me? So actually, let me just set a waypoint to see if I can find this table, you know, before really getting into the mix. Because I do definitely want to make sure I get that done. All right, we made it to the to the stables, man. But what I did want to say, I did get my, I did end up stopping um Hungarian. Yeah, I want to upgrade this new one I got. It is a standard horse, but it's big body, and I like that. So I'm gonna upgrade this thing, cause. But what I did want to talk to y'all about, I did end up stopping. Um, I did end up stopping at the barber. You know, I got my boy Arthur looking back proper, kept the handlebar mustache a little longer, the chin a little longer, you know, just a little bit. Since you Clementine uh, the second, you know, you got to kind of have similar swag to your moms, you know? Oh, with the white mane low key? Oh, uh, hell yeah. I like that. And then now for the tail. Let's get you... Little fine grooming always sets off a horse. Let's get you that braided right. Know what I mean? But yeah, when I was getting... All right, Arthur's bet. hair back right, I was looking at this man's face. He looked so sick, bro. Like, oh my... Like, I was looking at him. His eyes look all around his eyes. Like, his eyes were red. The outer side of his eyes were all, like, purple, bro. It's like, damn, man. The hell happened? Like, I mean, I guess we know what happened. But, like, still, bro. Golly, man. Okay, we're gonna make it all one name then. Clementine the Seconds, bro. Yeah. There's your name. Clementine the second, bro. You know, we can't disrespect Clem like that. You know, we just got a successor, man. Yes, sir. That's all I wanted to do, I think. I think everything else is all good. Hey, I just wanted to bring that up, bro, because that was so crazy. Uh, now, this is officially Clementine the second. Um, Now that we got that done, let's go see what Charles wants before we hit up Sadie. But yeah, I was getting Arthur back looking right. And like, you know, obviously in the barbershop, you can see his face. His eyes is red, around it is like purple looking, bro. And I'm like, damn, like I obviously Arthur's sick, like health is getting worse. Like we could tell. Cause I did notice when he first started coughing, it could have been earlier than this, but just when I first noticed it was when we were doing one of those last few missions for uh, Leopold Strauss, you know what I mean? But we were doing them Strauss debt collectings. And bro. It's like ever since then, he's just been coughing more and more and more and getting worse and worse. And like, bruh, I am not liking where this is headed. Like, they're really about to give my boy Arthur the Itachi treatment. And for those of you who watch Naruto, if you know, you know. <laughs> you know what I mean? If you know, you know. All right. Uh, where that boy Charles at? Charles, is this you? Hold on. Oh. I was finna try and get my weapons off my, my horse. Friend, my friend. 
friend. It is me, Charles Chatonnet, the painter. Why are you dressed like that? Okay. Like, you see, I got well, Arthur back looking like swaggy. That? Oh, I am a wanted man. Look at his eyes. My like, y'all see Arthur's as eyes? As it is. <laughs> Look at them. I don't think that... The art is the problem. He looks sickly. They say leave. Go far away. We will never understand you. Did you see I'm back crispy? I go to Sandani. They say that is not far enough. Okay. It seems to me that they were right. Why are you just like a no, woman? I go to South Pacific. Why was he on the run, right? The light there is perfect for my work. After that art so show, they wanted to the whoop him. I'm telling you that just to get you on the other side of the world. Right. Perhaps it doesn't matter. Help me get to the next ship. They are watching the port, and I need a chaperone. So you want me to look at his eyes, y'all? Oh. Arthur is so sick, bro. Like you couldn't even shave to play the part. You just painted your facial hair, gang. I tell you what I want, Miss Civilization. Hold on, bro. Before that, before that, bro. Yeah, okay, this. I kind of know what you mean. No guns, I guess. I would find my way in the country founded by Puritans. Yeah, after that art show, know. you're not welcome in these parts, brethren. Arthur, relax. <laughs> relax, why? A little too much pep in your step. But yeah, he's wanted in these parts, basically. After that art show. So, what do you want me to do about it? Okay, bro. I guess. <laughs> I don't think they'll recognize you. I didn't recognize you, bro. I'm on your, I'm on your tail, brother. Like you gonna, you gonna bring my horse back to me now? You, we going pretty far, man. <laughs> we are away. Come now, follow me. Charles, what am I gonna gain out of this? <laughs> well, I mean, this is last mission. I might as well do it, right? Right. I'm hoping that was an expression. Oh, you're nasty. You're just a nasty individual. I thought you were just like misunderstood, but nah, you're really just a terrible person, bro. <laughs> I mean, I know I'm one to talk, but golly. Back, back. The money lenders. We go another way. That man. They recognize you. Even in your dress, bro? They recognize you? How that work? Quickie. Ew! <laughs> Bro? I mean, it's not on my lip, at least. I thought I knew him. Charles, you're weird. Please do not do that again. Right? Now get moving, come on. Get out of here with that. Get your ticket and let's go. At least it wasn't on the list, but like, watch out. What's up, boy? Right? You ain't made no profit? He really just tried to smooch me, like... Watch out. New kind. I don't know how you get down, bro. I see. This better be your last mission, bro, because after this, I'm done with you. You just been wasting time, man. Uh oh. Why are you flirting with him? Do you not see that's a man? Like, you see the chest hair and the facial hair, bro? Now it's all oh my goodness, but you was just trying to get on that. Like, bro, you was just trying to get on her. Oh my god. Them drunk goggles hit different, huh? I was going to Sick man. You're the only one talking. Like you would have thought he would have shaved his facial hair or wore like a a dress that covered higher, bro. We can still tell you a man cross dressing, bro. Money borrowing, wife stealing. Right? got a way of ingratiating yourself with people. Terrible. He catching all these looks? It would be very boring. Like, he's not fooling anybody, bro. The feeling the purpose ain't to be hated. Right? Not really. If you were loved, you wouldn't have to do all this, bro. Just saying. Alright. Look at where this that light, that kind of life led you, bro. I know, boys. Why are you flirting back? Like, right? If you don't keep it pushing, bro, <laughs> you do not have to respond every time. Just go, so just get out of here, man. I'm tired of you, Charles. And he walks between people. I hope the sailors know who they're bunking with. Right? They don't try nothing crazy. You're gonna be a girl all them weeks? Right? I'm glad I'm not part of it. Up here, she is my sheep. 
Alright, get on that and get ghosts and hopefully I gain something out of this, bro. <laughs> I really just escorted you to the docks. I thought it was gonna be something more, but I guess, bro. Alright, man. Oh, no, 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 no. oh, what the? What the hell? What is your issue with me? You don't even know who I am, nor why I'm here now, bro. Y'all wanna play these games? Y'all said, look, Arthur looks like a ghoul, bro. We? I may be sick, but I'm still whooping all y'all behinds. I don't give a damn about your makeup. Weave, weave, you got a knife? Is it that serious? Boy? Boy? Stop blocking. Stop blocking and die. The hell? Put my hat back on. Come on. Hope the ship's leaving soon. Arthur looks so sick, bro. So you just made me waste my time? I don't get nothing from this. Adieu. Merci, mon ami. Goodbye. If they don't like you in Good the riddance. Island, keep on going to the South Pole. Yeah, don't come uh, back, yes. bro. I hear there the light is really fantastic. Uh, au revoir. Yeah, you're you're for sure a character, bro. I'ma loop these people though. Good or not. They try to fight me. And I'm wanted. Isn't that nice? Well, low level crime. Okay, I'll just leave the area. I mean, I don't have. Oh, man. He really put me in a bad situation, bro. Because I don't have. Uh... I'm going to just do this real quick and then I'm going to cut around the back. Excuse me. Excuse me. Stop and stay still. Hey, man. Freeze or die. Final. Hey, man, it's not that serious. It's a misunderstanding. What the hell? I'm out of here. You're not gonna make me lose my honor. Charles, you see what type of situations you get me into, man? Hey, y'all, y'all finna shoot a civilian, not me. Oh man, it's hella of y'all. And I'm all the way away. And I'm all the way away from my horse? Ain't this a sitchy, huh? Okay, hold on. Watch it, bro. Not too much now. Not too much now. Excuse me, bro. Excuse me. I'm just trying to get by you, that's all. Arthur, what is his camera angle? Get out of here. Get out of here before you die. I'm like, bro. Snake maneuver this thing, cuzzo. I did not do... This is what I get for helping Charles, huh? He said this is what I get for helping the bad guys? He didn't see me. He just didn't see me, bro. All this because I wanted to help Charles before Sadie. Well... They said this what I get for doing side missions. Where my horse at, man? I need my horse to get to me now. Come on, Clementine the second. Prove yourself. Prove yourself now. Golly, man. I didn't do anything to deserve this. All I did was a side mission. Come on, horsey. Ooh, 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 ooh. Not a good idea. That's a good You're not gonna catch me, bro. There's no way they did. There we go. Here's my horse. Get on your horse, Arthur, and dip. Get on your horse and dip. Get on your horse and dip. Get on your horse and dip. Hold on, bro. Hold on, bro. Get on your horse and dip. It was not this serious, though. It is not this serious, man. Yeah, I'm giving y'all the slip. Y'all are wilding right now. Like, that I too next year. Let me. Let me do some of that moonshine before they kill me, bro. Like, bro. I didn't even do nothing to y'all, man. I'm gonna just have the waypoint at Sadie's mission. I'm not gonna go there, obviously. But I'm gonna try and go to that general area. So when the law. When I evade the law, you know. Damn, I'm running right into y'all, huh? Oh man, hold on, hold on. Oh my gosh. Um Come on, horsey. I gave you health reviver. Okay. Well This is going so bad. This is going so bad, bro. I'm taking me over them, bro. Me and my horse over them, bro. I ain't do nothing. 
I'm finna die, bro. Come on. Get up. Get up. Get up. Let's go. You're being so stupid. This is a death here, y'all. It, it just is. F this stupid horse. Clementine the second. Clementine can never be topped. That's what, that's what I learned, basically. That's basically what I learned, bro. This is ridiculous. Give me this. I'm out of here. F that horse, bro. F that horse, bro. This might just be a sign to just get Shanae and leave it at that, bro. You know what I mean? Come on, Arthur. You can't eat while you move, Arthur. Man. This is so stupid. Hold on, bro. This man, Arthur, about to die. Like, like for zero reason, too. And you drop down. There's no way they find me here, right? Like, bro, all this because I wanted to start the day with a side mission. I'm still wanted, though. I'm gonna try and get out the area. Golly, man. That's ridiculous. Oh my gosh. Come on, horse. Come on. You better get me caught up again, bro. Oh my gosh, this horse is selling my bag so badly. I did all that work to get off, to get away. Oh my gosh. This is so bad. Watch it, bro. Watch it, bro. Watch it, bro. Watch it, bro. Dismiss, Arthur. Dismiss. Oh my gosh, where's my horse, bro? This stupid horse. Like, what is this episode? Look at this horse running, no! Stay here, we're leaving. Get out of here. Like, damn! Oh my gosh, there's no way this horse is about to die again. There's no way. Eat that and shut up. This episode's already off to an interesting start, bro. Who else needed Arthur? Turn faster, turn faster. And who else, who else? Get everybody off me. Who else needed? Bro. I'm taking your horse now. What was the horse you were on? Of course, nowhere to be seen. Yo, you're about to take three horse revivers, bro. Clementine 2.0 is dog water. I can pay off this bounty. Watch it, bro. I literally did nothing to deserve this. Like, bro, I, use, I wasted three horse revivers on you. Oh my, you're about to die again. You're about to die again. Oh my gosh, climb up, Arthur. This is ridiculous. This is so stupid. And the horse instantly runs away. Like, what the hell, bro? Who wanna come up here? I'm sick of y'all. I'm sick of y'all. Y'all are not serious. I have done nothing to deserve all this smoke, bruh. I try to surrender, they instantly shot at me. So what's up? What's really good? What's really good, bro? That's not even how this episode was supposed to go. That's why I shouldn't be doing side stuff. That's basically what they telling me. I'll pay this bounty off. Like they don't gotta call Lester in this game, bro? They just gonna keep coming? Like, bro. Okay, and I got no qualms killing y'all. 
Keep coming up. I'm going to kill y'all until I run out of ammo. Leave me alone, man. Jesus. Y'all haven't had enough yet? Yo, I hate this horse. I should have known Clementine could never be topped, bro. Climb up here, Arthur. I don't know how I'm going to get out of this. I think it's just grits. This is ridiculous. Please make that jump. Oh, my lord. That would have been so bad if I didn't. Like, bro. What the hell? I did nothing of the sort to deserve this treatment, bro. Literally. Wasted three horse revivers. Hella ammo. For what reason, though? Like, because people wanted to fight me on a side mission. They acting like this, bro. Realistically, I should be able to take cover here. They just see me? <laughs> like, we're not being serious right now. We are not being, like, we are just not being serious right now, bro. Y'all are doing entirely too much because people wanted to fight me. This is happening because people wanted to fight me on a side mission, y'all. Like, you, do you hear me? Oh my lord. I'll die if I go down that way. Please, please, Golly. Please. And now you just got me again? Wow. I hope this is all worth your time, y'all. Where my horse at, man? Where my horse at, man? Come on, Arthur. Get on your horse and get ghost, bro. Let's go, girl. Jesus Christ. Hold on, before anything. What is going on? What did I do to deserve this? What is this, Lakay? Because clearly I'm not wanting here, bro. We need to get out of town and fast. Hold on, bro. Horse, you need stamina? Oh, my lord. And you need health, bro. Oh my god, I swear if you die, Clementine, two point, Clementine the second. Like, you are so butt if you die. Bro, how much stuff do you need? Here, take this. Back up, man. Y'all are doing too much when I didn't even do anything. Jesus Christ. Eat this carrot and shut up. Easy, girl. Golly. There's no way he's on meat that hard. Look at this dude behind me on meat. My lord. It was never that serious for a side mission. Like a side mission, bro. Because people wanted to fight me in a side mission. All that happened. You had me twisted if you thought I was finna yeah. do anything but that, bro. I'll pay off that bounty. But y'all tripping, bro. No way they're coming out here now. Thank you. Leave me alone. Damn. Oh my gosh. Was it ever that serious? They pressed me like that for what reason, bro? Oh, because people in the side mission wanted to fight me. Like, bro, damn. What is y'all issues, man? Well, now that it's nighttime, a whole bunch of other missions want to pop up now, bro. Like, now the mayor's mission want to pop up? I mean, I did want to do this. Might as well try it now. But, like, damn, bro. It was never that serious at all. All right, let's see what the hell the, hair wa the mayor wanted from me. I said the hair. Um, he said go around the back, right? Like, bro. 
I'm glad I didn't lose no honor for that, because that was BS, y'all. Like, like, be be serious, y'all. Alright, Clem, Clem the second, I'll leave you here, bro. Golly, y'all can't lie. That whole thing was a whole bunch of BS, man. What was I really supposed to do there? Uh, I cleaned all my guns. Let's see what this what the man want, bruh. Know what I mean? Gotta have my guns out just in case. I'm so glad I could still do these side missions, man. But damn, that was so unnecessary, y'all. I'll pay the bounty off. This is one bounty I'll pay off, because that was so foolish. But it's like, I'm not finna die off that. Are you crazy? <laughs> I went out like a G no matter what way you slice it. Mr. Lemieux, it's your fave outlaw. Idealism and pragmatism for beginners. Yes. Uh, I'm, um, uh, uh... What name you going with? I'm looking for, um... Look at his mayor. eyes, y'all. Yes, please. Uh, Mr. Kilgore, uh, yes, sir. Kilgore? Or what was it? Tacitus. Uh, um, I forget. <laughs> Welcome to government. He knows... Democracy. An interesting idea. He knows I'm an interesting character. What's up, man? Monsieur Lemieux? Lemieux. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Oh, hello, friend. Mm -hmm. Hello. Tacitus Kilgore. What's good, Playboy? Oh, really? Okay. Do you know my real name no, or look at his you are not eyes? Going to rob me again, are you? Like you see what I mean? It's purple no, and red. I... I'm sorry. Uh... <laughs> Don't worry about it. Right. But you I thought are you not said a very popular man. Oh, uh, trust me. There's all kinds of nasty people want to speak to After you. After what just went Mr. down in town, Tacitus. I know. I for I know. sure know. They won't hear anything about you from me. Yo, his eyes is bloodshot, y'all. I'm sorry I keep talking about it. Of course, I'm a politician. Need for me? Nobody. We are not savages, merely Frenchmen. So you say? Ridiculous killing. Oh, dear. Okay. Terrifying, yes. I suppose I can do that almost as well as kill. Yeah, I could put fear in people's hearts. Now, it's all very ethical. You see, I've been trying to I look clean, but sick. A place of culture to elevate people's souls. And what do museums need? Uh, art. Right. And so how you want, do you buy art? I don't know. I just got rid I of an artist. Art of some nasty little man from Paris. And Charles? Some destitute aristocrat's collection of old masters that it turns out he may have been painting himself. Charles Chatsonet? Is that who you're talking about? But these are good paintings. I just got rid of them. I can't make the difference. And I'm French. Only this even nastier little man from New Haven has. Nah, they must be talking about someone else. Paintings, and he's saying that they're all fake. Because this wouldn't be available after that. So, that what so you need. perhaps he can be persuaded to revise his opinion. Oh, Got you. So, exactly. so you want me to say now, him? Your paintings is real. Mr. Arthur. Oh, I mean Mr. Tacitus. So he does know my name. To meet a little professor shitface and have a word with him. He knows my name. He said it. Suddenly welcomes you like a son, sir. Not after what, what just went down in the town. I better bet. I better get a cool perk like on some GTA. Get the get the cops off me, Lester style, bruh. <laughs> Doing this mission for him. If you don't mind, the gallery is just at the end of this avenue. Oh, okay, if you say As so. I said, he's a beastly man, this professor. Believe me, friend. Look at the law still on me, though. Yeah. Not even close. You know, I thought we French had a monopoly on arrogance. About to but see no. me put some fear in this America man's heart. Be far, far worse. Got you. Luckily, there ain't too many overeducated Americans around. Right in this day yes, and age, hold on. The mayor had such grand plans for our city and its people. We shall have truly broad democracy. I'm trying to make sure those Working these cops the don't see me. Like. Right. Give travesty for this one man's opinion. <laughs> Look at them all on the Did road. Opinions. Oh, every corner. They don't need cops Sending everywhere notes. like that. Oh, they change all the time. Of right. Course. Our reason is not to be underestimated. The gallery is just up ahead. All right. Are we sure we're not talking about Charles French painter, bruh? Like, there come on now. There. Oh, that's who we Whoa. need. What's his name again? Right. Professor Shiftaker. Shiftaker. Professor Shiftaker. Hey, Amen. Until he reaches us a clear area. Like, as the mayor, you should, like, give me a feature, like, like I said, let me get the cops off me, because I would have came in so clutch just now. Buenos dias. Buenos dias, sir. Buenos dias, my brother. Can't, can't interact right now, though. Oh, got some business to handle, man. You don't mind me. 
Like, I was finna say, I got Arthur looking back clean again, you know? Looking swaggy. But, them eyes, bro. He's sick. Sick as a dog. It is too obvious now. Hey, Mr. Chef the Car. Professor? Excuse me. We gotta talk some Hello. about some art. The mayor asked me to get a preview of your findings in there. Yeah, if you don't mind. He knows very well what I found. Every painting was a brazen fraud. I need you to say that's cap, that's gang. A big claim. Right, we need to One say that's clap. Upset a lot of people. Myself included. And you're not gonna like me when I'm, I'm angry. That's just hard cheese. Alright, I'm about to turn now you I into Swiss cheese, bro. Hold on. I see it's gonna take a fist in your right. face to persuade you. You about to turn into Swiss cheese, brother. Wait. What's up? What's up, man? I gotta punch you to change your mind. Say it's cat. I, I couldn't. My reputation. I said say it's cat. It's cat, ain't it? Ain't it cat? <laughs> ain't it cat, boy? How about your reputation now? <laughs> I'd never be published again. So, okay, you got pride. I'll give you that. But is it worth losing your life for? Is it cat? <laughs> I relent. <laughs> relent. Are you sure? <laughs> okay, so we did get him. I only took three punches. Two punches and a kick. Um, like every time I see his eyes, bro, I can't get hyped. He's really getting the Itachi treatment. and love them. So you're helping people, really. Yeah, you're helping more than you know. It ain't worth your life, ain't it? me upset with you Because I will spin the block. Oh, I know. Send the mayor what he needs. Because um, what? I'll be in New Haven. No, right. No, we don't want that. That's what I thought, I man. Paper this evening, sir. Thank Very you, good, good sir. Yes. Thank you. Very good. Now get on, man. Get on with your bad self. Return to Jean Marc. Okay. Let's hope I can return safely, bro. <laughs> Make sure the law. I'm telling you, bro. I should get some type of like law immunity. Like, like you're the mayor, right? Like, come on now. Where's he at? Oh, he got off the horse. I'm like, yo. Yo, gang gang. The problem been dealt with, champ. So you gonna write that paper tonight. Out. All those paintings were real after all. Uh, who would have guessed? Who would have guessed, bro? The mayor shall be so pleased. Sure. Was, uh, Thank you. Professor Shiftaker happy to change his mind? He wasn't initially. But, you know, uh, he came around. He came around. <laughs> right. My lord, this is not right. Trust me, I've done much worse. Right, you enlisted my help. Here's open. Yeah. Uh, thank you for the money. Mm, thank you. I mean, I guess money. Money works. I do need some extra funds to pay off this bounty after all. Yeah, Arthur, we don't read papers. I don't know why he handed that to me like I was gonna read it. Yeah, we don't do papers, bro. How do you do? Uh, what's good, bro? Oh, not you. What's good, gang? Hello. Nice to see you, brother. All right, we did the mayor's mission. We can say that. We can say that, Jay. Right? Good, you know what I mean. But I do need to pay out the Saint Denis bounty because, like, I don't care. I was not gonna let them take me off of something stupid like that, bro. That was so dumb. <laughs> it was so dumb. I could run to Sadie's mission though. I wonder if I oh, let's do Sadie's. Like, since her mission's right here, you know, we finna do that. But I wonder, will it make my horse spawn in front of me? Because Marco's mission is only in the night, so I gotta wait to do that. So now we can finally go to the uh, side, uh, main missions now that we did some side stuff, you know what I mean? Sadie Adler. So the bar's not available, but the mission is. I could run to her. As long as no policemen. Oh, I thought that was a policeman. <laughs> I got scared, bro. I'm like, you know? I gotta play my life out here, man. It's an evil world we live in. What the hell? I can't run. <coughs> what the hell? He just coughed out blood. Yo? Hello? I was trying to get to Sadie. Oh man, Arthur. Mister, are you okay? I told y'all, just looking at his eyes. Mister, are you okay? I've been seeing all the coughing from that Leopold are mission. Okay, mister? Arthur's really getting that Mister, Itachi treatment, bro. You don't look so good. 
Yeah, trust me, I've been saying that. You got doctor money? You got insurance? Good insurance? <laughs> like... Come on, it's not far. Just down the street here. Oh my, I thought we were just about to do Sadie's mission. <laughs> he really... He's really getting the Itachi treatment. He coughing up blood. Give me a minute. He coughing up blood, bro. Oh my god. Arthur. This basically guarantees like Y'all giving Arthur the Miriam from Hunter Hunter, Itachi from Naruto treatment. Go on. Thank you, good my good sir. Arthur, you finna go a fork in the road. You finna go out like this, Arthur, from illness? I need your help, baby. Can I help you? I need a I doctor. Need a doctor. Dadly, I'm coughing up blood. Oh, uh, just one second, sir. Yep, that's the same one who chopped off old dude's Come arm. In, Come in. You gonna make me walk or? Oh, okay. Oh, uh, this is like you hear him breathing. I don't know what it could be. Yes, I need some help. And so it seems. <coughs> oh, Let's God. Doctor, mister, to you. Oh, okay, I can sit. Uh, I was joking. It has to be something with his Friend, lungs, I though. Mean nothing, but you got money? Yeah. I mean, before I start treating you, because I got a family. Yeah, like, I'm over saying. here coughing up. Here, Look at him, it. bro. Oh, sure. Thank you. Now, what's wrong? I mean, what appear to be the symptoms? Coughing yeah, up blood? Coughing. I was gonna say blood? like sometimes uh -huh. tuberculosis, like breathe. What's any what's what's something else with the lung? I don't know. Again? Wait, he got blood all on his mouth from Let me ah. see your tongue. I say ah. ah. Watch it be too late to treat it now, huh? Cause he been coughing for, for a minute now, a hot minute, y'all. What is it? Not good news. Well, I guess that. Right, you're not just coughing up blood willy you got nilly. Tuberculosis. I'm really sorry for you, son. It's a hell of a thing. How bad is that back in the what day? Do you mean? You're real sick. You. How bad is it in it's general? A progressive disease. And I don't know much be, about it. Now the best thing is rest and getting somewhere warm and dry and taking it easy. Now that's not the is life that possible. No. Sure, I can just take my winters in my country club. Yeah, I that's just not possible. No, it's not possible. Can you cure it? Well. Or is it like you like just I said, I, you just got it and I'm that's sorry. it? Yeah, well. That's just it? Yeah, well, wait, wait. Uh, is there something you could do about it? Let like, me get you a little bit more energy today. I'm about to look up tuberculosis, like, right after this. Because obviously back in the day, like, the medical stuff is butt. Don't give me an achievement after that. Leave the area. Can I eat something? No. Oh man, Arthur, hold on. Why are we doing this? Let me look this up. Because I've heard of tuberculosis before. I know there's something with your lungs, but I don't know anything other than that. A potentially serious infectious bacterial disease that mainly affects the lungs. The bacteria that cause TB are spread when an infected person coughs or sneezes. So nowadays, it's partly preventable by a vaccine, treatable by a medical professional. Spreads by it's airborne. Medium term revolves in months. Oh man. Some people can have a Latin tuberculosis infection for a lifetime. Oh my gosh. Can it be cured? But I mean, I'm assuming back in this day, like, this is today's stats, bruh. Are you kidding me? Like Arthur said, bro, we cannot catch a break. We can't change what's done. We can only move on. What the hell? Tuberculosis is... What did Itachi have in Naruto? I know it was something with his lungs, bro. 
You have it in you. I can tell. Like I said, Itachi treatment, but I didn't mean he. I didn't think he was gonna really start coughing up blood. And like, and he just has it. It's just GGs. He's just gonna die. They did he say. Didn't have a choice. He was good, and he did good. They did say it's a progressive disease. Oh, I mean, I guess it's karma for the life Arthur lives, but. Oh my God. I understand if you don't want to help me, but, but I think of you. He over here thinking of Mary Linton, bro. You don't have lungs, Arthur. And he started, he had the nerve to start the episode smoking a cigarette. A deer? Why is there just a deer in St. Denis? Hey! You are sick. While sick, you will only gain the benefit from consuming a limited amount of food and drink? Yo, this actually sucks. So if I eat this... Arthur, what the hell, man? I mean, we are right with this Sadie mission. So it's just GG's? Like, obviously, it's back in the day. So, like, it's probably not curable. Is it really gonna kill this man? Arthur passed out in St. Denis and wakes up to find a stranger dragging him to the doctor's surgery. So that's really a main mission that we just... Oh, that is so butt. Sadie, let's go save John, bro. I knew, I knew I wasn't bugging from the way he, I like, I knew he looked more sickly. <laughs> Icarus and friends? Oh Any my Any problems gosh. coming in? Nah. Guess they know now we ain't in the city. Arthur, you gonna tell everybody? Look at him, yeah, he look like a ghoul. Since you boys disappeared. I'm sorry I keep talking well, over the dialogue. At least you're alive. But what the hell? Now, yeah. Yeah, heavy on the for now. In, um, Guam. Yeah. Heavy on the for now. <laughs> what happened to Dutch? He seems. I don't know. He, she is so seems pretty. Like what began happening in Blackwater began happening here years ago, maybe. Micah got so in his ear. Crying, I guess. What do you mean? She is so I bad. Sure. I'm sorry. What happened here? But this man Arthur, bro. I started bro. gathering people up as best I could after you boys left. And right. John, you know that part. He got I caught do. up. Is and that my I horse? Know. Thank you. So that too. Hell, yeah. R.P. Hosea. Well, robbed the morgue and buried them together. Oh, y'all really stood on business then. Follow me. Let's go, Clem the second. This man is really sick, though. Like Arthur, go. I mean. I guess in this life, that's the best way to go, huh? Because it's technically natural causes, assuming he doesn't die beforehand. I should have known from the fact... What's your plan? Hold on. I should have known from the fact that in the original Red Dead, Arthur's not the main character. Because this, it, at the end of the day, this game is a prequel. So Arthur did have to get dealt with some way or another, bruh. And I'm going to be honest, I did have a feeling like... Stories like this, when do they ever have a good ending? But tuberculosis, Arthur, that's how you go out, man. And that's no disrespect either. Like, I'm not even saying it that way. It's just like, it's just because it's like so like definite. Like back in the day, obviously, a common cold was taking people out. <laughs> I'm not sure if it was at this time, but back in the day, bro, like, you know, we, they weren't as advanced in medicine. And I think it's a lung disease, bruh. Like, what can you really do about... Like, the doctor said, it's just... You, I guess, what, just try and take it easy until you go, basically? But in the life we live, we know we can't. I just wonder... Arthur, are you gonna tell everybody? Because, like, everybody been seeing you coughing and stuff. Are you gonna tell them why? That's why? You got limited time? But then again, with a rat in our group, we can't even confide in our people, man. Oh, and I can't even say he don't deserve this because Arthur is not a good man. But it's like, bro, y'all made me play like 30 something, 30 plus hours with this man. And who, and who knows how much longer we got to go in the story, bro. 
He's sick. Oh my well, god. Well, I figure before we do anything, we need to make sure John's even still at this prison. Are we? And how do we do that? And they expect me to just move to on. enough to get a proper look at the place. Hold on, bro. And they expect me, like, yeah, Sadie, you beautiful. I'm glad you stand on business. We about to get John, but, like... It's on an island, ain't it? Unless you're planning on learning how to fly. My concern is how the hell exactly Arthur finished. what we're gonna do. I found us a hot air balloon. I'll shut up. <laughs> I'll shut up. Now, the pilot, or whatever you call him, he right. thinks we're just in it for a lesson. Bit of a tour. And we over here trying to get a bar back. the character. I think you'll like him. I still... <laughs> Thank you, talk it, man. I'm impressed. You really stepped things up, ain't you? Is Sadie in the first Red Dead game? We didn't know if you was even coming back. Hey, you let my time I'm back finna be short. Real hard. Somebody had to step you can up. See it. Heron's gone falling fully into the bottle. Yeah, alcoholic Trump's now. Bag of nerves. Swanson, well, Swanson's actually gone and cleaned up his ass. Uh, he stepped up because duty so called. I guess it ain't all gone to shit. Yeah, somebody had to step up in place. Able to find us. Right. Javier said he got the letter I left at the post office. Uh, that was a good idea. Right. Until the Pinkerton showed up. Now nah, that was Bill's fault. I'm not gonna lie. He has everybody right. in town like a I'm dummy. Hunting O'Driscoll boys. Oh, you getting back for Karen? Who the sons of bitches at a campsite last week? Okay. What? Stand on that business. Seems they've drifted down this way now. Here's the hot air balloon. Busy woman, Sadie Adler. She is so her. She a beauty, ain't she? You? Oh, the air balloon, my fault. Yes. Right. Mr. Bullard. All right, good. I keep my guns Mr. with me. Bullard. Oh, ah, Mrs. Adler. It's good to see you. What's good up, boy? To see you. Ah, uh, this is my friend I told you about. Nice Mr. to meet you. We got the ah, same yes, mustache. Handlebar. At your service. Nice to meet you, Arturo. Well, it's a nice, fresh day for flying, sir. A day like today, and Icarus would have made it across the sea. <laughs> have you ever flown before, sir? I'm not gonna lie, bro. I'm so Attack on Titan brain rotted. <laughs> I saw a hot air balloon. First thing I thought of. Hey, bro. Y'all watched the uh, uh, Attack on Titan OVAs, the original animations, bro. Armin, uh, and not even even the kid in story. You know, Armin's parents, bro. Damn. I miss Attack on Titan, man. It's just too good. It's just too good. You said that's you don't care about that. It's Red Dead time. You're right. My fault. No, oh, it's quite a thing. Quite a thing. I really can't believe this now, man got tuberculosis though. Put these on and hop in. Like obviously. Is she coming? Ah, uh, well, women can't fly, sir. Are you insane? What? Yeah. Oh no, sir. It does terrible damage to them, to their vapors. So that's why she well, needed me to come. That why a delicate flower like Mrs. Adler. <laughs> Heavens above or below. <laughs> as she spits, as he Where turns around. Find this guy? Right? I Is he sprung? Get on. Uh, are you sure about So this? I'm doing this certain, dolo. Sir, quite certain. Why they never Business? let us do stuff with Sadie? Let us away. Wish us luck. I've only crashed twice. Now, uh, all right. On, well, at least you live. And hope for the best. All right, Sadie. Love you, baby. See you later. Oh. You boys have fun. We were, the ascent prompt shows your current altitude. The yellow altitude marker shows the desired altitude. What? Why am I flying this? Time to catch a few vapors of our own. It's a little overcast, but I'm expecting some good wind once we're high enough. We should still have some decent views over the river. The life you live, Arthur Morgan. Now, one hates to be coarse, but on the subject of ablutions, right? Liquids over the side, solids. Do your utmost to levy the situation until we land. I don't know what you're talking about. I had a client once who fell foul to a rotten oyster on the ascent. What do I do here? Decidedly harrowing experience for all involved. Oh, I see. I'm holding it to the yellow part. Okay, got you. Keep going, sir. We need to get up above the clouds. But to, it really he really got the Itachi there, treatment. Nothing like it. I was just yapping. And obviously he was getting sick, but it's so serious, bro. Started coughing up blood, passing out, and now I'm playing sick. All right, man. Let's like, come on, man. Cows. Come on, Arthur. Oh. But like I said, God. you're at the altitude. Yes. What's the best yes. wind flow? Yes. Remain at this altitude Watch to keep your speed up. Isn't it? Feels like we have a nice westerly wind, so keep her around this height. Okay. 
I'll try. This particular vessel is state of the art, sir. Are Imported we moving? From Europe. Okay, we are. Find more than a couple of these on this side of the pump. I just need to maintain the height. Hold on now. Alright. You sure you shouldn't be doing this? Right? Like oh, not at all. A child could operate this with a little supervision. I'm not sure if a child should be Mrs. operating Adler this. Told me you were very keen to learn the ropes. We have plenty of those. So she, she did. <laughs> right, like did she now? But they really I know I'm a broken record, bro, but tuberculosis. Like, I should have known from the fact that Arthur's not the main character in the first Red Dead. I didn't think they were gonna, like, kill him, though. But the doctor really just said, Ah, oh, damn, yeah, you got tuberculosis? That's crazy. <laughs> That's better. Look, we can see for miles now. Like, I could have told Arthur that. Arthur and Arturo. How perfect is this? He really hit us with a My damn that's crazy. A student of the Italian eight. Try and rest if you can, bro. Desario, so you could say I got off light. Look, I'm Desario is crazy. Right here. Man, I'm trying to talk to my peoples. Say, Did you breakfast in the city this morning, Mr. No, Mr. I just came from the doctor. Well, I have a boiled egg in my pocket here that you're very welcome to. I'm not reaching in your pocket, bro. Thank you. Recalling the blue. Right, I'm not in the business of of pocket food, bro. You better pilot this on the way back. I'll tell you that much. But man, Arthur. Like, obviously, a game like this can't have a good ending. But damn. Got you interested in the pursuit of aviation. Can you mind your business? I did, exactly. Right? Mrs. Adler thought she'd surprise you. ask a lot of questions. Very nice woman. And no shrinking violet. The hell does that mean? I prefer slightly more feminine. Tire on a lady, but now nah, she's perfect the way she is. Alive, as they say. She's perfect the way she is. That's why we love her. You finna be in the cell next to him, bro. Go yapping. Oops, sorry. See that building up ahead on the island? I don't see the infamous Sisica Penitentiary. Okay. So I'm really breaking in here to get John. Too near to it, though, sir. Sorry, we're going in for a closer look. Right, yeah. That's what do you mean? This is why I'm here, bro. Just letting you know. Mr. Morgan, please, this is most irregular. Nah, bro. You want a happy customer, don't you? Right, don't make me write a bite Yelp review. Animal. What on earth are you doing? I will knock you, you out of this air balloon, us. bro. Calm down. They won't care if we stay high enough. I'm just looking for a friend of mine. Right, that's all. Friend? Yes, sir. Poor bastard has a habit of being in the wrong place at the wrong time. Right, you wanna you don't support false imprisonment. In fields in a chain gang. Right. Dear God. You can't support false imprisonment, man, right? Oh uh, hold on, it's six o'clock. I gotta do something real quick, y'all. My fault to pause it here. We back, we back, my fault, my fault. <clears throat> I still can't get over this about Arthur, man. He really going out the true Itachi fashion, bro. The wind. Well, this is most unusual. Relax, Mr. Bullard. Take over. Right. Keep us well away. Use the binoculars to search best. the fields for John. This filly isn't the easiest to control, you know. Right. No, not there. Uh, what other direction you need me to look at, brother? We look a little ja. suspicious, wouldn't you say? There he is. That could be him. That's for yeah. sure him. That's <laughs> yeah, I recognize that's that hair anywhere. Are they about to shoot us down? What? what Guess we land in this thing. I can see that. Right? Ascent. Ascent. Oh, okay. I'm ascending. It takes a while. It takes a while to ascend, man. Whose fault is that, though? Like, it's yours. Why are you pressing me about it? You were supposed to keep us out of good life, bro. The wind speed is picking up. We should stay at this altitude. It's heading northwesterly, so that should take us back to land. I mean, we found John. We found John, but like, we still need him. <laughs> we still didn't get him. We're in the clear now, Mr. Bullard. Get up. They instantly started busting though. My heart is pounding. Like you could have asked questions first. I must say, the good thing they popped the balloon. Job not described me at all sufficiently. Well, it's done now. So all we had to do was locate him. 
He barely on the whole island. How are we gonna get him back? I thought we were gonna get him back just now. But that is reckless. So we just had to make sure he was there. Ah, there's Annisburg. At least they didn't make me do it back. Good lord. Is that, is that Mrs. Adler? She waited for us? We're being chased. Look how sick this man looks. Oh, she's out of there, though. Try and get us near. That the feds or what? Will there be more trouble, sir? I expect so. All right, bro. I'm starting to rather enjoy this. You can shoot that out there? Hey, Shane, up here. I'm like, Shit. hold on, bro. Cause you wilder, gang. Ooh. This is oh, just cool. Okay, hold on. God damn, yo, aim good. You shot me from up here? Yes, she does. Keep us steady, bro. Get that jump pop, Arthur. He gonna be jealous of the life you live? He wish he was getting this mixy? Hold on, who else is there? I shot something. Damn. Sadie, what did you do to piss them off? Okay, hold on. Hey, give me some. Give me some more dead eye. Hey, man, I'm trying. Boy, get lit up, man. Do your thing, Sadie. Yeah, get out of dodge, sis. Golly. So you are enjoying this? This is hard, bro. Okay, it's not letting me tag. There you go. Let off them shots, Arthur. What did you do with it, bro? We just been riding. Yo, these shots not hit it? I'm like, bro. Well, there he go. So, Arthur, what are we doing? Guess your brother ain't gonna find out about this story, huh? We finna lasso her in here? You better hope no Drisco don't grab that rope. What the hell, Arthur? Look out! There's a bridge up ahead! I'm I'm ascending. Come come down and get you on the other side. Okay. You hear him? The ascent will turn red if you are too high. Release Archer to descend. How low you want me to get, Sadie? Make up your mind, sis. All right, hold it there, Arthur. Let's get out of here, baby. These missions are crazy. All right, I'm already holding R2, bro. Oh, I can't hold on much I got you, baby. I got you, baby. I got you. Come up with Uncle Arthur. I'm a little sick now. <laughs> My lungs ain't the best. But I did, I do be hitting arm day, baby. Oh, get your fine self. Ooh, our fine self. Let's get out of here, bro. I located John. Brace yourself. So what we finna do? Brace yourself now. Damn. Well, that happened. I don't think so. I still got messed up lungs, though. Maybe. <laughs> and he still got... Damn I mean, it. that Look, cough ain't going nowhere. Them on the other side. So what, we she finna get Mixie? Get behind something. This ain't over yet. Say less, then, bro. These goddamn old tricks. We wouldn't want it any other way, though. Boy. Just kill these sons of bitches. Yes, ma'am. Don't gotta tell me twice. Oh, my gosh. Headshot red dot. Everybody's tired. We really still dealing with O'Driscoll's this late in the game, bro? Like, bro. <laughs> y'all still y'all still haven't had enough yet? I'm like, is there? I'm like, bro. I see red behind us. I knew I wasn't tripping. 
What's up, y'all? Who need it? Hold on. I want to use some more dead eye. What do I got to res to restore dead eye? What's up? Who need it, bro? I'm gonna be real swaggy with this one. That's it. Oh my gosh! That that I that I is so lit, bro. I, I waited too long to start using it. Golly! Why did my audio just trip out like that? What? Shut up! Oh, that's the semi-auto with it. You see that moving faster? Oh yeah, this is Sadie's get back because they messed up her real fa her other family life before we got her. Hold on, I'm finna hit this man with the meat. Nah, don't run. Yo, why is my audio so trash right now? Like, this is the worst possible time to do so, bro. Hold on now. That's it? It's only one of y'all? Okay. I'm like, I know there was... I know there was more than one. What's up, bro? Y'all play too scary. Get in the mix. One down. Sadie, get my back. Two down. Three down. What's up? This semi-auto don't play. What? Boy? No spleen for you. Where you running to, boy? Ain't no running. Ain't no running. You don't get to run. You don't get to run. No, sir. You get walked down. You don't get to run, boy. I'm finna loot you because you're right here. You don't get to run from us. <laughs> Not from this. You don't run, boy. What's up, Sadie? What's good, baby? That's standing on business right there. Left you an hour. Right, how did you can't stay out of trouble for one goddamn hour? So she you found them? Bastard killed for his troubles. I kinda liked him. <laughs> Comb. The government. They got Comb O'Driscoll. What? They're gonna hang him in San Denis. Hang him? Okay. Mm -mm. He's already been tried twice for murder and found guilty. Sure, no doubt he'll escape again. No, he won't. Oh, so you wanna kill him? Sure of it. I what? We have our own problems with the law in case you ain't noticed. Right? I want to see him swing. Sure. I mean, yeah. You wouldn't even help us with Marston. Oh. And our situation is really messed up right Can't now. take unnecessary you know risks. This. Bastard's going to swing. I'm going to make sure of it. Closely followed by Marston. Right, we need to save you him. You saw him? Yes. yes. In the fields. Binoculars and all. 4K. Okay. Then we go rescue him. How you suppose we do that? State penitentiary. This man no. Arthur looks like a ghoul, but from bro. The fields? Yes. That what we you can mean? manage. It's well guarded. Guarded, sure, but not behind bars. Fair point. No, it's not behind bars. Right, he out in the open. So, that's how we'll do it. With the rope. Bust him from his work detail. I guess. She is so savage, though. Just the two of us go. Right. Less numbers, less chance of risk. The two of us is all there is, anyhow. Good. Because two is all we'll need. Oh! oh a little one. Okay, we'll baby. Sneak in and get him out of there. Meet me at Copperhead Landing. Say less. Thank you, Arthur. Anytime, Where my love. Say, boss. She is I so fine. That. Bruh, you can hear all of it. I don't care. <laughs> Yo, fine, so. Pick and examine herb. Hold on. Is this this Yarrow stuff? That William want? No, that's a regular. now. I mean, loot, I'm gonna loot all these people before we move on to anything else, bro. I never felt like da -da 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 -da. All right, now that we looted everybody, I guess let's make our way back to back to Dutch, man. So we could I think we did enough side stuff, you know what I mean? Till next time, what's good, baby? Let's just get on you and get out of here. It's getting dark outside. When it get dark in this game, I don't know how I feel about that. <laughs> That's what some BS be happening, man. Hold on, what is this? Crafting tools? Oh, I could just craft straight up like that, huh? Okay. So this is just all my recipes and stuff. Got you. All right, man. Yep. Let's make our way back to camp. I looted and booted all the Odriscoll's. You know what I mean? You thought If you thought I was missing out on that much loot, you were crazy, man. Yeah, so I guess I'll worry about paying off my bounty last time. The only thing here is Dutch. I promise you I'm probably not going to do this William mission, to be honest. 
Uh, nobody really brought up bounty hunting, and that stranger is mad far. We'll probably do that next time. <laughs> Just keeping it a bead with y'all. Hey, okay, what the hell? What the hell just happened? Yo? Nah, y'all tripping, gang. Y'all tripping, gang. All oh, y'all. I don't know what y'all got going on, but something ain't right. Something ain't right, bro. Hold on, Arthur. Relax. Yeah, Arthur, relax. Chill out, bro. It's a good thing I caught that. I'm coming, lady. What happened? Right. Those fellers, nasty bugs. I'm sorry they killed I'm... your mans. <sighs> I'm fine. I think they were saving me for something else. Oh, I'm so uh... sorry I came too late to help your mans. You're one of the good ones, ain't you? Uh, I like to think so. Thank the Lord. For that. Anytime, man. You need a ride back. Get me out of here. I, I, get me away from these men. Hey, man, I got you, sis. I can do to help you in your time of need, man. Yeah, I got you. I'm in residence at Hansburg. If that ain't too far. I got you. Right. Oh. After this, you. I'll make sure you get home. That's very kind. Anytime, just let me make sure I get my loot from these men, and we'll be on our way. I'm not finna loot your husband. That is very foul. It's a good thing I caught them before they got her, bro. I'm so sorry I, I came too late to save your husband, madam. Get on, baby. Damn. What alerted me that that was, that was her husband getting shot, man. Was there a way I could have saved them both? Nah, because there's not enough horse pay for both. <laughs> like, I got you, lady. So, can't imagine right. This was your first dust up with those bastards. What's going on? This weren't my first run in with those crazy hill folk, if that's what you mean. Crazy hill folk. Never too long before they make themselves known. I, mean, I never even heard Whenever of them. Whenever their appetites grow past what they find in the hills. The cannibals? Still, poor Bradley. Golly. He wasn't the brightest nor the bravest. R.I.P. Bradley. Oh my, no one deserves that. Right, all I heard was a gunshot. See the fella with you? Yeah, R.I.P. Yeah. Bradley Hunt. You know him, Arthur? Friend, my cousins. He's taking me home. Oh, just a friend. Guess okay. He thought he could talk himself out of the situation with them. And got blamed up. He's about his own skin, huh? Right. Doesn't sound like much of a man. Damn, Arthur. Yeah. This is best thing to dead? Maybe. Maybe not. Good Damn, it's hard to come by around these parts, though. Hey. Real men ain't like fellas in the books I read. Am I one of the good ones? I beg your pardon? Just hope I can trust you, mister. I got sure. you, sis. Oh, and there's an office here I could pay my bounty off? How far, how far is where she live at? Because I could swing, I could for sure swing back through here and pay this, pay my bounties off, man. Depending on how much money I got. Does she got a post office where she at too? Okay, perfect, perfect, perfect. I could just wait to, to pay it there too, even better. And I could fast travel with the stage coast, I'm pretty sure. Damn, they did her foul, though. All I heard was a blam. At least it wasn't her husband, though. Just a family friend. Golly. Well, they... I actually don't even want to know what they were saving her for. At first, I thought she said cannibals, but, like, you know... Back in these days... A woman alone... Even, not even just these days. Just, like, you know, situation like that... I'm pretty sure we could all imagine what they were saving her for, bro. Good thing I saved her from that. If I didn't hear a gunshot, I probably would have ignored the stranger thing. So, sorry to say, miss, but your man did have to get body for me to pay attention. My fault, because I was for shelf in a high tail and right back to Dutch. I don't think I've ever been to this area, though. Annisburg? I'll just get you back safe and sound, okay, sis. Now. All right. You know, it's my pleasure to save your life and bring nice. you back home. Riding like this almost makes me forget about what happened. Now you can Can't take your mind off it. If it ain't on horseback. Uh -huh. what you do, mister? Ride, Ride horses. The country, help people in need. To an extent, Sometimes. right, when I feel like it. When I'm in my good We're Samaritan here. mood. Uh, just drop me off right in front of the saloon. Yeah, I ain't never been over here, bro. Ever. Okay. Here. Oh, you are too kind. 
You have acquired ingredient required to craft a bear claw talisman. Hey, anytime, baby. All right, let's see. Can I get to this post office though, to so I can pay off this bounty? That would be. Back to the wolf poor woman, am I right? All right what I do want to do though, while we here, um, can I enter here? Pay your bounty to use the stagecoach? Oh, that's all I gotta do? Um, how do I pay my bounty, man? I got a bounty I like to pay. Let's pay some bounties, man, I know. I don't even want to know where that money came from. Oh my gosh, how many bounties I gotta, oh. All Lemoyne bounties that much? Um, I'll pay this one. Where'd you get all this money? Actually, no, I don't want to know. I'm like, mind your business, man. New handover, do I care about that bounty? Not really. If you wouldn't mind coughing in your sleeve, sir, I really can't afford to get sick again this month. I feel Why you. Why don't you just do your job? Damn. Uh, of course, sir, sorry. It's just a polite request is all. Damn, Arthur. Wait, train tickets? Where can I go? St. Denis? Um, all right, let me pay off this bounty so I can just use the stagecoach, man. Which bounty I gotta pay off? You got the money to pay all that off? This one? Can I use the stagecoach now? Yes, I can. All right, just get me back to, to camp, Thanks, right? Martin. Can this just take me straight back to camp or like, what's up? Or do I gotta ride all the way there? Uh, take a ride? Where I wanna go? Back to St. Denis? Sure, is this just a waste of money? We make it back. <laughs> we'll make it back. It don't matter. Let's get some fast traveling. First time I ever used it. <laughs> hey, Clementine the second is following me. Yeah. Just take me there so I can get to Dutch and wrap this episode up. Man, I can't even say like this isn't like every episode of this game is a good episode, but tuberculosis, Arthur. God damn it, man. All in one piece too. Thank you, my good sir. Hey, thank you, brother. Nah, they got they got all nefarious acts there, bro. Uh, can y'all? What did you just say? I'm like, can you move? Okay. Appreciate the ride, big bro, and thank you for following me, Clemmy. Easy, girl. Thanks for following me, Clem the second. Uh, hopefully, I can keep this horse alive. I you I wasted three. Horse revise on this one. You better stay alive now. Paid off my bounty, my mess from earlier. Let me save now that I paid it, just in case, bro. <laughs> just in case. Hold on, I know I said I was finna go help Dutch, but you won't believe who this stranger mission is for. <laughs> Y'all won't believe it. Y'all will not believe who the stranger mission is for, y'all. When I pull up on them, you're gonna be like, oh wow. Hey! Sister! My sister, my sister. Oh, please tell me you don't need money because I'm broke. Y'all said to make sure I do these missions. A men of angels. How is brother Dora? Right, hopefully he's well. I'm not doing the best. Y'all said to make sure to do these missions. sent overseas, you know, do something with more challenge. Maybe uh, be a missionary. Mm. He's a lovely man. Yeah, he's pretty cool from what I've seen. And how are you? Ah! Never better? Yeah. Are you sure? Yeah, Arthur, we all know you uh, capping. Quite sure, sister. We can see it in your eyes, brother. You know, a long time ago, I was like you. I very much <laughs> What do you mean by that? Terrible things. Awful things. Uh? And I could not stop doing terrible things because I did not believe that goodness existed. Right. And then one day, I saw that love did exist. And ever since then, doing bad things became... Well, it's possible, but pff, ridiculous. So what you trying to say? I guess I'm just hoping for a, a dignified exit. Art there. Oh, I mean, I guess you kind of get in there, huh? Sister. Natural causes. I'm an outlaw. <laughs> oh, you were <laughs> honest. What fun. Religion is just a word. Mm -hmm. Hearts are rarely pure, but equally, they are rarely impure either. Right, it's a gray That's area. An interesting way of putting it. To me, gray area. God is people, and people are God, so mm. we must all do what we can. Okay, she got people an interesting outlook. Starving. Go find them some food. Don't worry so much about your heart. The actions will lead, and the heart follows. Whatever that means. I'll still think of you in 
very nasty terms. Well, damn. Wish. So he wants to be a bad person? Donate food, donate 10. I'll donate some money. Please, a few. Uh, you know what, sister? I've got some money right, here right now. You can I'd rather keep my food. food with this. You can just oh, take the money so that I can make Mr. back Morgan. anytime, no, sis. True. I meant wonderful, but so very frightening. Right, aren't there? Like, you got a good heart, man. You just do bad things. I want to be seen as a bad guy. Damn, you still want more? Oh! Consider your good deed done oh, mission complete. I won't subject you to any more benevolence. <laughs> Thank you, sister. Sister Ethel makes a fabulous stew. They will be so happy. Hey, glad to help any way I can, sis. Thank you for always looking at me with kind eyes, even though I don't deserve it. Focus on the work at hand. Okay. See you later, sis. All right, we are back at camp to see what this man Dutch is talking about before we wrap up this episode, man. Charles, my geyser! What's good, Genge? Morning. Morning, you brother. I really wonder if Arthur is gonna tell, you know, tell the peeps another that. Day. Hey, another day, another Not dollar. You feel me? You, you good? All right, all right talk to me. Like you don't know. That you fumbled the bag? We're all in this together. Right. All right. Okay, why you always gotta be stink? Like. Damn, bro. Well, let's see what the day brings. Uh, Javi, right my boy. Nice to see you. I almost wish we were back in Guarma. Damn. I know. That bad? Um, I don't know if you want me to hitch the horse anywhere. I'm gonna just get off here. Let's see what Dutch talking about before we wrap today up. But before that, I also do want to, uh, get these weapons off him just in case, you know? Oh, well, I can't even pick what weapons I want to use because we're, we're at camp right now. Right, 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 right. That's right. All right, Dutch. What you got in store, man? Micah. So we're back. Mr. Bell. Mm, that fool Williamson. Let him write to us. Oh, trust me, I know. I don't know. Don't matter now. Could have been you. <laughs> we know you're not ten toes, bro. Anyway, I'll leave you to it. All right. Morgan. Snitch. <laughs> Snitch. We know about you, Micah. I don't need to wait for the game to reveal it. Dutch, my. Dutch, I got something very important to tell you, man. Like, Arthur, you gonna tell him? Two, three, four, black. You okay, what are man? you talking about? He over here talking about chess moves? Working it all out. That's Once Murphy country? All, Arthur. Mm. What you mean by that? What now? Right, talk We're to me, back. brethren. And I'm sitting here. We are so and back. I am contemplating the great journey of the sun and considering a famous chess move. See, I know a little bit of Those chess. Those oily and actors of a mediocre justice, the Pinkertons, and right. the benefactor, the depressing millionaire, Leviticus Cornwall, they want us, Arthur. Trust they me, I know. Us. And they are going to have us. Well, maybe what you mean by that? They ain't the problem. Meaning? I don't know. It's just, well. We doing stupid stuff. I can't stuff. help but feel we would have been better running off someplace else. <laughs> Instead of right back. The game ain't over, Arthur. I mean, I ain't, I ain't played my my final move, but I guess I'm more interested in saving lives than winning Playing. a chess. I mean, mm. life ain't such a thing to cling on to so tightly, no doubt. Trust me, I'm what on my way out, bro. What about you Jack? Like Jose. I miss. Aw, oh, man. Um, R.I.P. I asked you a question. What do you think? That just lost, bro. We can't bro. stay here. Yeah, that lost soul. Where are we gonna run to? I mean, they chased us from the west. They right. chased us over the mountains. They ran us into the sea. We were in a Guarma. Came back. Do you have my back? Of course. Always, does. Right? You have the nerve to ask but me after all this? No back to worry about. We got twenty we backs, bro. Money. We've been on the run for months now, and I seen you mm. killing folk in cold blood like you always told me not to. And mm. I'm sorry, but I can't help but think that if we just... There is country in Roanoke Ridge past Butcher Creek. That's our new I spot? we could hold. Okay. You and Charles, you can take folks up that way. Okay. Mike, and I need to do some reconnaissance. Look at him already pushing I me out. I final plan. Yeah. Arthur, I ain't got it. Why you want to do reconnaissance with Micah? I just need time. I need time and no traitors. What the hell, Dutch? How you gonna say you need time and no tra- Look at him grilling me! 
Are you good? Look at him. Yo, if he said he talking about he need time and no traders, but you want you and Micah to do reconnaissance? Micah got in your ear, gang. Look, y'all are good for each other, man. Piss off. He is still grilling me from back there. Hey, Charles, we got a dip, fam. Be right with it's me. always me and Charles. Yeah. Ugh. Charles is like one of the realest people in this game, bro. Creek. That's who we just dealt with. That's who we saved the lady from. Did I just get a sneak peek of the area where we about to go? So am I about to get into a new chapter already? We're looking for a place to hold up. Right. Even the law won't follow us up there too willingly. Yeah. I did some scouting up there while your boys were away. Are we gonna move yeah. or? Hmm. You'll see. Is that bad? Arthur, why are you walking like that? I, I get you're sick, bro, but like, tee up. It's always me and Charles. But why would Dutch need reconnaissance with Micah? Like, what? Since when is that just a thing, Dutch? He really trying to push me out. I mean, I guess he tired of Arthur pressing him, but like, bruh. Okay, girl. I'm like, we gonna act like those horses aren't stuck to each other? <laughs> we need to get this done fast. All right. Pinkertons will have reinforced in another day or two. I mean, this spot wasn't yeah. permanent, though. That's the true. Get out of here, the better. That is true. Yeah. At least I got to do some more of the side stuff in Saint Denis before. Right up there. I saw some canoes near the bridge up river, which would take us right up to Butcher Creek. Might be quicker. You want to do it like that? Think? Um, sure. Yeah, boat's probably a good idea. Why not? Okay, good. If you suggest that I trust it. It's good to see you again, Charles. Right, bro. You one of my you favorite too. characters, man. I Thanks missed you. For what you did in San Denis. It been you and me from the jump. You're brave drawing them off us like that. Right. I was worried you and Abigail had both got yourselves killed. Real ones. I found a spot to lie low for a while. Then managed to get a ride with a wagon of workers heading out to the fields. Mm. Abigail said she somehow managed to slip away when they grabbed Isaiah. Yeah, how the heck did she do that? The others out of there. We still need to Keeping get John back, together. though. Everybody was pretty shaken up when I got back to Shady My Bell. honor's pretty high. That's uh, good. It was a tough few days. I couldn't have done it without hey, Shady. Put some respect so on Mrs. Adler. He's not just a pretty face. I assume the skulls on sticks weren't in addition to yours. She's staying on business. <laughs> Old Strauss knew about it. The locals are terrified of the place, so mm. we figured that might buy us some time. Some people don't go did. poking their noses out. So one of you brought the law with you. Bill. And where did you end up again? Cuba? Warma. Oh, uh, not exactly. Right. Off of there, called Warma. Damn near though. Landed ourselves in a heap of trouble. Fought a whole war. A tropical island. <laughs> Isn't that just what Dutch wanted? Apparently not no more, bro. He want Micah with him. I guess it didn't exactly live up to his ideals. Dutch is so flawed. I ain't always sure Dutch knows what he wants anymore. He for that if Perhaps he got not, Micah doing reconnaissance, hell no. To figure things out in the past. I know. We gotta stop living in the past. Just it's been a hell of a game. A hell of a twenty episodes. And his, uh, wisdom. R.I.P. the ghost. But that really irks me, bro. Like, Dutch got me, got the nerve to get mad at me for holding him accountable to the same standards he holds everybody else accountable to. But then just wants to surround himself with yes men like Micah. Like, bro, your plans involve all of us. Why are you mad that we are getting in some say so? I get it. You have a lot on your plate. But listen to us. <laughs> Like we all want what's best for the group. You over here letting Micah lead us, letting Micah lead you, make you lead us straight into hell. There's the but you want to run reconnaissance with him, like bro? Why? They got the nerve to get mad at me. Right here. Huh? Let's get up there, then, man. Whoa. I'm only going here because you said it was faster. You know, I don't know how well, much faster. That'll do. Come All right. On. We don't need two separate canoes. I am not. I'm just not rocking a bow, gang. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on, Hosea. I am not rocking a bow. I'm not. <laughs> I said Hosea. I mean Charles. My fault. I miss. I'm missing, man. My real father figure. Cause I don't know what the hell Dutch been on lately. 
That's fire that I really did put the name of Clementine a second, though. But, man, Charles. At least I can count on you, man. Okay. Butcher Creek is a few miles To control the boat and hold X to row. So I spent some time up this way while you were gone. Okay. Ran into rain's fall and the eagle flies. The Indians, at least it's pretty easy to control. I'm trying to help out a bit where I can at the reservation. Okay. Things are bad there. How bad? Because, you know, Charles is half Indian. He's mixed. Right. Some men there spoke a lot about the Murphy gang that hides out in these caves. That's going to be the new ops. We're going to need to be careful. They're animals. Everyone is terrified. I mean, I just saved a lady from them, bro. He probably didn't care to check. Hiding up here. Not a crazy idea. Is this the reconnaissance? This is a spot nobody comes near. Even the law. Is him and Michael gonna do reconnaissance here? Like, where are they doing reconnaissance at? So be it. They doing reconnaissance or plotting? You know what I mean? Like, you never know what Micah. Oh, okay, y'all got it. Ugh. The canoe kind of fly. <laughs> I'm glad I chose it. I feel like Dutch and Micah are gonna like prioritize themselves over the entire group. So me like. Like, when we get John back, like me, Sadie, John, Charles, we're gonna have to go after Dutch and Micah, bro. Like, I feel like that's the trajectory they're going to take. And, like, Arthur's probably gonna have his last stand with Dutch. Like, because I wonder, is the game really gonna, even though Arthur has tuberculosis, is the game gonna let him go out from tuberculosis? Or is, like... Him and Dutch gonna have a standoff where they shoot each other and they both die? Or something, bro? But my question is, if that does happen, is Bill gonna side with us or side with Micah and Dutch, you know? I was gonna say, are they friendly? Oh, God. Well, this our new, this our new camp. We stopping here? Let's walk it from here. I'm like, where, where are we stopping, bro? Talk to me about it. Oh, man, bro. Good evening. And somebody said, I'm still nowhere near done with this game. So I am scared. Because <laughs> if there's still so much game left, they let us. I feel like they let us have all the good times, bro. I feel like now... Like, obviously, this whole game has been, like, a downhill trajectory in terms of, like, our group successfulness. I feel like now it's finished come crashing down, burning. You know what I mean? Like, at a rapid pace, bro. And I am scared, bro. I already got diagnosed with tuberculosis. Okay, bro. Thanks for the heads up, I guess. The doctor really said, Hey, man. Your lungs is cooked. That's crazy, gang. Take it easy. <laughs> like, it had the nerve to charge me for it. If you want. You probably won't miss him if we get him back by morning. Um. Okay. Let's get on these horses then. Let's get on these horses then, man. I'm still following you, playboy. But like, the doctor really had the nerve to charge me to just say, Damn, gang, you got tuberculosis. That's crazy. Take it easy. See ya. You can see why like, don't wanna come I could have told him that. Ain't exactly a welcoming place. You got your PhD Lots from Scam University? These parts. Just recently, a stagecoach from Annisburg. Annisburg. That's why I just took the girl to. Guess that's good for us. Golly. Assuming these inbred bastards are willing to part with their home. Right. Which I'm sure they won't be too pleased about. Not at all. But I believe they hide out all over Roanoke Ridge. These caves are just one of their spots. So we got to be real cautious. So you keep it down. Right. They might have lookouts around. They might snipe okay. us off the map. I was going to say, they probably racist, Charles. Like, you know, you got to be like more double the times and careful than Arthur got to be. Can all these little squirrels and stuff move? Slow down. Keep it quiet. It could be some of them. Hey, man, I'm matching your, your speed, man. However you go, I go, bruh. If we gotta shoot, then we gotta shoot. I say we dismount here and follow them on foot. See where they're going. All right, man. Follow me. Stay quiet. Let's do this thing, Charles. 
So he said, stay quiet. So I'm going to just have my knife out just like he do. Maybe I should have kept my bow on me. Golly. It's always me and Charles finding new camps. But Dutch want to prioritize Micah over everybody. Like Micah's his son. Got the nerd to ask me if I still have his back. It's been 20 years. If I didn't have your back, you would have been dead 20 years ago, bro. Like, Dutch, I get it. You're under a lot of pressure, but tighten up, man. Like, oh my gosh. Y'all feel me, though? It's like, do y'all feel me? Definitely, Murphy's. I say we deal with them from here. You take one, I'll take the other. All right, say that now. Because I do the skinning. Well, how about I do the skinning? Then who do the carrying? You're a son of a bitch. Um. Okay then. Uh, did I not just stab you? I'm late. We must be close now. I didn't know how you wanted to do it. This hill there. Hold on, you got a machete? Give me that. Hold on. No. Give me that machete. Thank you. <laughs> Actually, hold on. Let me get some loot. Let's see what these freaks have. You know? Maybe a new area, but I still gotta make sure I profit off these things, man. I'm sick. You gotta make sure I'll take this stuff to the grave, man. Alright. Can't carry any more of this item yet. Let me get that machete. You got any throwables, Charles? Because I don't know what you meant. You said take him out. And you didn't sneak up with me. Come on. Okay. You said F stealth now? Like, <laughs> I'm following you, bro. My, so, when are we gonna get John back? Let's see what's going on. I thought we'd get him back before we move camp. Alright, what's the mode? Arthur is still so swaggy, though, even with. The bur oh, what is that? They must be in the cave. That's a human? Alright. What's the Let's move? Get on with this. We going in loud and proud? Hey, what you think? I'm gonna head into the cave or flush them out with dynamite. Oh! Man! Dynamite be safer. Right? Yeah. I'm not putting myself at risk. Be quiet and hope they don't come out. Let's get this over with. Let's flush them down with that dynamite. This is their territory. They're gonna have the advantage if we sneak in there all dumb. You feel me? Like. Let's dynamite to join up. Charles? I'm so I like the options they given though. You know, really make really personalize the experience. I don't even know what is that. In a bit closer and then throw it into the cave. Okay, throw dynamite into the cave. Go on, Arthur. Hey man! Oh what? Let's do it like that, bro. I mean I guess stuff might have been smarter. Here they come. But hey, man, I feel like this is better overall. I can't even see. They are crazy. Whoa. We have to. Okay, so we got to get in there regardless, you said? I could worry about looting after. You were wrong about these crazy sons of bitches. Heavy on the. Whoa. Okay, hold on. Right? Oh, wow. He one taps? Trying to get all three of them with one dead eye. I didn't know he was that fire close up. All right, bro. Throw it into the kid. I did not know, bro was bro was like that with it. That's insanity. Looks like it's on there, Charles. Let's go, Charlie boy. Here they come. Come up, Charles. These boys is really crazy. You see him? That's why I got the semi. Let's move on. That's why I got the semi auto. You go first, Charles, cause they a little too about this for me. God damn, bro. I know Charles ain't just get lit up. Oh my. Third time's the charm, ain't it? Third time the charm, ain't it? Let's see how this gonna work, Charles. Talk to me, boy. So we cannot let them get close. Cause they will one tap your life. Let's get in there. They the one tap champs. Apparently, bro. Okay, 
Yes, sir. They the one tap champions, bro. There you go, Charles. Let's bait them out of here. You in the way, Charles. I can't shoot. I'm like... Move in on them. Really? We sure that's smart? I mean, we got to clear this out, right? The hell going on here, man? So, okay. Let's do this then. I wish I could see better. That would be phenomenal. Charles, stay with me. Hold on. Hold on, bro. I'm just staying scoped in. I can't see nothing. Like, they one tap, bro. I'm not trying to be a victim of that. You see? Okay. You don't got a machete, though. You're not as scary. Head tap. Who else need it, bro? What we finna do? Yeah. Y'all machete boys is crazy. Did she say no when I killed him? You like him? Hold on, Charles. Yeah, he don't got eyes, bro. He dumb. Charles, you see more? You good? Come on. Let's get that poor girl out of the cage. Where's that? I'm like, how do we get it out this? Hey, hold on. We ain't gonna Chill, hurt. miss. We saving you. Don't touch me. We saving you, miss. We saving you. Friendly. We're friendly. Relax. Relax. It's okay. We're friendlies. We killed them for a reason, miss. Calm it down. We got you. Okay. She joining the group or? We got you. It's time to go. Come on now. Ain't gonna let them hurt you no more. Is she somebody or no? Okay. We all good. We the good guys. Well, not the good guys, but better than these guys. You, 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 you know where you, you remember where you from? Well, we'll take you home. Where you from? Right. Mantisburg. You want to go back or? What we do with her. Take her then. I'll go get the others. Okay, no. miss. Uh, if you will, will you ride with me? I'll take miss. you home. You cannot tell okay, me I'm right not swaggy. You I'll know? Keep you safe. She don't trust my eyes. She look healthier than me, and who knows what she been through. <laughs> look at Arthur Strongbody! Okay! Annisburg, right? He said, get in the gym, little man. Uh, you don't have to talk about it if you don't want to, sis. It's okay, man. I don't want to imagine. They killed them. You was with a group? You're safe now. Just try to breathe. And the take deep breaths. Oh, trust me. We know, sis. That's why we cleared them out. So, for, so some new animals can move in. Oh, man. Poor baby. Right, miss. Let it out. Arthur, let her cry it out, bro. She, you know how, like, how messed up her mental state probably is, Arthur? Let her cry it out. Just evil. Ain't no point trying to explain. Right, like I do bad things, but I got a decent heart. Ah oh, man, <laughs> hope you can get a good rest once you get back home, man. I know. It's the second time I saved What's the woman name? from them. Yes. They're freaks. Okay. Meredith. Meredith. You're gonna be home soon. Nice Meredith. to meet you, Arthur Morgan. This will all be over. Arthur Morgan's the name. Thank you. Now go introduce yourself. Kind of rude. One of the mining cottages. Okay. If you get me to the main street, I can show you from there. All right, man. Okay. Just try to relax now. I did go to Annisburg and dealt with them before. That wasn't our first showdown. Who would have thought that side mission, that well, not side mission, but random event, would have foreshadowed what are we finna get into in the next episode, bro? Oh, man, bro. All right, baby. I got you. Ain't nobody gonna hurt you while you on my watch. Golly, I don't even want to imagine what they captured these women for, bro. Like, you know, the mind can only imagine so much. Can't understand the sick, twisted actions of sick, twisted people. That's how you, that's how you go to their level, trying to understand them. So I wonder, was chapter five, is it really going to be over when we get to this camp? Chapter five, just the shortest chapter of Red Dead so far? Okay, I could go faster. I didn't know she was going to talk or not. I can't blame her not wanting to talk. But that's crazy. I was literally just here before coming back for this just mission. Just head for the main street. 
it'll be easier to walk from there. You got it, sis. Oh my gosh, what have they done to you? Good morning, sir. All right. Yeah, I was literally just here, bro. Took the stagecoach from here to St. Denis. All right, Missy. You want me to walk you there? Oh. Oh. Golly, bro. Thank God. We walking you from here? You saw a dude posted up with the- Up at the top of the hill. With the blick? It's near the black. On the mountain? Ma! So this gonna be the new town? She's alive. Oh, she's this gonna alive. be like our new Saint Denis oh, Valentine. Pretty bad things, I'm afraid, man. Murphy brood guys. Oh my darling. Yeah. How did you manage? Oh, to? I just ran into them and found her. Right. Thank you. Stood on business. Here, let me give you this. Ah, uh, you're too kind. Now nah, you're too kind. You're too kind. Oh, that, that's okay, Right. Keep man. your money, ma'am. Keep her warm. Use that money to feed her. Ain't no trouble. Keep that money and feed her some good food. She deserve it, man. Is that Mrs. Downs? Mrs. Downs? I knew it! You leave me alone. You just leave me alone. Oh! You ain't getting the coup you paid for. Mrs. Downs. We finally finna talk about it? I guess not. We just see her around now in random missions. That's what it is. That's what it went... Because I was wondering... Because we saw Mrs. Downs when we was on a mission in San Denis. I was like, are we ever going to continue that? At first, that's what I thought Meredith was. I'm like, they got Mrs. Downs? The Bruce got her? <laughs> but nah. She's just still trying to make her money, man. We ruined her life. I have to see it firsthand. She was a prideful, respectful woman, and now she just got to do what she got to do to make ends meet, man. How you get on? Messing okay. with the gang. Found a girl. Took her home. Right. Oh, you and... Mike, you find anything? Anything maybe. important? I think maybe. I found our old friend, Mr. Cornwall. Y'all got the drop? Yeah. He's buying a stake in the mine in Annisburg. Relentlessly ambitious fella. And we got to kill Cornwall at some point, right? He knows we're here and exactly what his plans are. So he never got in the mix with me, but got in the mix with Micah? Drunk as Saint Denis. You're back. How oh, jolly, wow. Mr. Oh, wow. you stuck a shit. Back Who and you? drunk. The here she go. Lord God I feel like Dutch gonna kill her, bro. I don't know if you're gonna kill her right here, but. Calm yourself. Miss. Dutch on a killing spree. He might kill her, bro. Okay. You know, kill a woman's not beyond him. I told them. I'm sorry. What? I told them. I tell them again. Now I've got God's ear. You told who? She what? snitched. Milton and Mr. Ross about the bank robbery, and I wanted them to kill you. You did what? She's. I loved you. You. She's the snitch. She's crazy. She ain't worth it. You told on me. Oh, you betrayed so now, me. What? She's the snitch this whole time. Get her out of here. Don't you waste know the rules. You are not so big now. You finna I kill her? Majesty. You. Take her. Who did that? Miss <laughs> Grimshaw did. Okay. I mean, she snitched. You knew the rules, Arthur. Right. She what had the to hell go. What's wrong with you, Mr. Pearson? Mr. Williamson, get this body out of here and get it burnt. So you okay. snitch, you die. Get back to work, all of you. Quit your lollygagging. I mean, like they said, get that's business. Work. She knew the rules. Damn, I was wrong. Cause I know Dutch is not above killing woman. We've seen that multiple. Oh, chapter six. Beaver Hollow. That's one way to start a chapter. <laughs> that is one way to start a chapter, man. But you see, Arthur's heart is getting too kind, too soft. Maybe so is it a bad thing if I get my honor high? Am I supposed to keep it low? Like, you would think you would want high honor, right? But, I mean, you get more benefits. You get cheaper stuff. People are nice to you. Less people trying to kill you while you're walking into town. So, this our new camp. Arthur still ain't tell nobody he said... <coughs> there we go. And he got the cigarettes right next to the bed, bro. Like, your lungs is cooked, gang. Give the cigs up. No traitors. That's Murphy. New horse are available to purchase in the Van Horn stables. Oh my gosh, before I do that. Damn! 
Let's just top that off right quick. Who was pressing her? Is that Tilly? <laughs> I'm like, who pressing her like that, bro? So, Anna Annisburg is the new town for us to find, mess around and find out in. Like, we see we got something here. This stranger mission I didn't want to do earlier now is closer to this area. And I guess when we come back, that's when we get John back. We gonna get John back when, you know? Lady asked you to meet her at Carpet Landing and take a boat over to Sissica Pen Penitentiary and rescue John. So when we come back, Stranger mission first since that's closer, then we'll hit up Mrs. Adler and who knows what other shenanigans we will get into. I think it's a good point to stop, you know? Chapter 5, the shortest chapter by far. Somebody in the comments did tell me chapter 5 was the weakest. Is it because of its length? Because I still thought it was pretty cool, bro. It was still clean to me. Oh, right. Y'all, that does it for another episode and chapter of Red Dead Redemption 2, bro. We knocked chapter 5 out in two videos. So I'm assuming, shout out to the homie in the comments who let me know. He was like, even though I already started recording chapter 5 beforehand, he was like, chapter 5 is the weakest chapter. To me, it was cool so far. But I guess, like, compared to the other chapters, like, you know, it was way, it was definitely way shorter. Like, you know, there was definitely way less missions. I think that might have even been shorter than the first chapter, right? Or about the same, because I beat it in two videos. <laughs> but chapter 6. I already have been told that we're not, I'm still not close to being done with this game. So, either chapter 6 is really long, or there's still more chapters after this, but I can't imagine what more they're gonna do after this chapter because arthur's sick you know he he's pretty much as good as dead he's just on borrowed time right now dutch and micah are tweaking out bro whatever they have going on you, you see they're starting to prioritize themselves over the group like i said now that jose are gone micah finna get in dutch's ear more and more now because clearly dutch don't give a damn about what i have to say even though i was the second longest running mate besides jose you would think he would treasure me more but hey he lost his mind. He's not thinking straight, man. I, like I said, all I have for this game now, like, obviously, I'm still enjoying it. It's, it's still peak gaming experience. But all I have is fear for how the rest of the things are about to go, bro. I could only see it ending bad, but maybe stuff will, maybe our luck will turn around when we save John. Hopefully, they don't kill Sadie. <laughs> if they kill Sadie, I'm going to be hurt, man. Because I feel like it's going to come to a point where I'm going to have to gather... Like, Dutch and Micah are gonna say, forget them, let's focus on us. And I thought it's gonna be a point where Arthur finally stops being a sidekick. Like, even though he's a main character, he's always playing second fiddle. So I feel like that's just, like, you know, he's like, you know, I literally have nothing to lose. I'm on borrowed time. It's about time I step up. Like, in Dutch and Micah's absence, bro, because, you know, Micah, we can't trust, and Dutch is cuckoo, so that's my prediction. Like I said, I haven't seen no spoilers for this game. Arthur is on borrow time with this illness, and I feel like he's gonna have to round up whatever's left, which will be Charles, Sadie, John, if we get him back alive. Uh, I don't know about Bill. I don't know if we could trust him. Maybe Miss Grimshaw. She gets in the mix, clearly, but after what just happened, how she pressed me, I don't know. I could only see this ending bad, bro. Like, there's literally no way this ends good, bro. This is a prequel for a reason. <laughs> this is a prequel, y'all. It has to end bad. There's stuff that happens after this for the first game, so <laughs> it has to be bad. But uh, yeah, bro, enough yapping. I still enjoyed this episode, nonetheless. I'm enjoying this story. It just sucks seeing, like, you know, we're fighting a pointless battle. It, it's like, it's starting to look like we're fighting a pointless battle, man, but only time will tell. So, hey. If you are still enjoying this series as much as I am, you cannot wait to see what Chapter 6 has in store. For, just like I can't wait, bruh. Make sure you slap that like button, leave a like so I know that you've been enjoying this series, and also comment. That's another way to let me know you've been feeling things and want to see more of it, man. Uh, if you are new here and you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Turn that bell so you're always going to know when new videos going up, because trust me, you are not going to miss a single one, bro. Dangin' and Red Dead have been some of my favorite games we have ever played on this channel, and you are not going to miss a single one. And I know you see behind me through the green screen what game is after Dangin', bro. 
when we whichever one of these games finish first you know that's coming up next right next but i'm a, you know y'all already knew that though <laughs> Uh, yeah, so if you don't want to be in the loop, make sure you never miss when new stuff is getting posted to this channel. Make sure you have that bell turned on. And if you haven't already hit that subscribe button, I greatly appreciate it, man. If you want to be in the loop, most hated news, make sure you follow the socials that are displayed right here. They're also always in the description below for the relic So if you want to follow me on, bruh, you know what I mean? Another thing that's linked down in the description, if you want to take an extra step to support your boy, consider joining that most hated mafia membership. You know what I mean? You can get some cool badges next to your name, some cool emotes to use, and live streams, comments, things of that nature, bruh. And depending on what tier you join, you can also get access to exclusive member-only content that you get here and there. You know what I mean? Because obviously, this is the main priority. So membership, not mandatory, but if you want to take that extra step to support your boy besides just watching, liking, and subscribing, man, you're always welcome to join the membership. Speaking of, always welcome in to join stuff. Another thing that's linked down in the description. <laughs> if you want to get into with the community on a deeper level, tap into the Most Hated Mafia Discord. The official link is in the description. Like I said, you know, we just be chatting it up in there. And we're always welcoming new people. Feel free. Don't be shy, man. Pop out. We fan. Well, you know, we got to get to get to usual chats and some yap sessions. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, speaking of community, make sure you keep it on that community tab. Because I do try and post on there as well, bro, when I can. As always... Love and appreciate y'all for all the support, man. I really do. Y'all have, like, taken the channel to another level on the support on these two series, and I'm so glad. I just hope, you know, I'm earning it every video, man. I'm trying my best, especially now that we back. It feels great. <laughs> hope y'all been enjoying the content since we've been back, bro. I love y'all. I'll see you in the next video, bro. Like I already said, I am terrified at what Chapter 6 might have in store for Arthur and the gang.